OK, so we're uh, back in now and ready to uh, paint our little terrain. So we're just going to go over to the paint uh, tool. Tools. Uh, now I have somewhere some uh, textures which will help us here. Uh, I'm just going to create a new uh, folder. I'll call it um, terrains. I'm going to add some uh, textures I purchased a while ago. No. Yes. Uh, oops, trying to find the structure I've got them in. Wait for my PC to wake up as it uh, tends to take a while on this bit. Sorry about that. Something to do with. Uh, scanning disks. I've got uh, a few external ones added which are a bit of a pain. Okay, so I'm going to be textures. Uh, I've got some natural grounds here. Um, these I think are a little bit too small. Um, they're, uh, I don't believe they are um, <laughs> I don't believe they'll they'll tile properly. Sorry, I was just trying to grasp the right word there. Um, so that's not really what I want. Um, but I've got some mixed bats from those. Uh, what have we got? Some bricks there. Must have some more somewhere else. Uh, it's quite possible they're exactly the same. I'm oh, not very organised, I have to say. Amazing textures, here we are. Okay, so we've got a few here that uh, might be useful. And I'm just going to select that one to start with. Okay, so that's kind of a grassy texture. Uh, so if we get to the top camera. And, uh, now I could use this to simply fill. But I'm not going to do that. I'm going to adjust my size to start with uh, and then I can use my fill. Well, we can see the preview there. I uh, can't really tell whether that's too small or too big at the moment. use our bucket and fill our layer. So take a moment or two. Okay, so turn that texture off and absolutely nothing's happened because deliberate mistake obviously of food layer zero. It's not a deliberate mistake. It's just a cock up on my part. Let's try that again. There we have it. It's filled it in quite uh, lightly. Uh, I suspect that's because I had transparency set. Um, well that's okay. It's just a start. That doesn't look uh, too bad. Which it's a little bit uh, tiled, I would have thought. We would really need to do for that is turn the texture back on again, uh, rotate it a bit, and then use a brush to give it some variation. Some soft brush. I'm 
going to paint over it various points nothing too uh, excessive twist it round and then open some more I'll continue this process until uh, everything is filled in as an alternative to doing a, a straight fill should just avoid uh, any kind of tiling differences we might get or you know, repeating of uh, the tiles. And it's well, you know, once you've rotated it to perhaps go and fill in some of the ones that uh, you've gone over the top of already. Just to give it a bit more. There we go. And we've got a bit missing down there. So that's our kind of uh, baseline. Uh, a little bit missing in there. Now I'm just going to go and find another one there. And I wish to have something a bit more grassy, I think. That one or that one? What do you reckon? That one, I think. Okay, so this is far more uh, grass oriented. You can see there's banding going on there with my texture um, because it's not um, tiling properly. Just going to go up to the top. Go over with that and see what it looks like. Okay, so it looks like I could have some. Uh, Grassy, uh, grassy herb uh, bits there. And these things aren't gonna, these textures aren't immediately going to kind of blend in with each other. Um, I think that's kind of fairly normal. Uh, we can do something with that in a little while. In fact, I'm going to completely undo what I've just done. 